Well, greetings everyone. Welcome back to Haunted Hotel Ancient Bane for the PC. Um, if you're just joining us, um, this is a hidden object adventure game, which is a new series I'll be starting on my channel. Uh, as long, you know, of course, with my other uh, trucking simulator uh, games. Every now and then I might do an occasional old school game, but this is probably the trucking simulator games in these type of games will probably be what, what you'll find on this channel. But anyway, um... Okay. So, alright, well, when we last left off here was we, uh... Well, we found an entr entrance to this dungeon here, so we gotta figure out uh, where to go from there. I see you. They are everywhere. Okay. Oh, I'm so fucking scared. Acid will dissolve this metal. Okay. All right. So we got a bow amulet. Ew. No, it's not a bow amulet. It's a bow am amulet. I mean, it's a... <laughs> there's a difference. <laughs> yeah. Ew. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, let's see what we got here. We got duster, a stamp... No branch, but a harpoon. Okay, well that that's not that's solving nothing. Okay. All right, so um, I'll meet you back upstairs where um, you know remember the whole time um, in room thirteen I think. So I'll I'll meet you guys up there. Um, that's where that um, that bell sample thing goes. So meet you over there. Okay. So remember this room in, in, in room 13? See that symbol thing right there? So we have to use that. That. And some acid. So now we have to take the acid and I don't remember what I was supposed to do here. I think you're supposed to make some sort of uh, weird potion-like thing there. I don't remember exactly where that is, but I'll meet you. I'll meet you back down there in the uh, uh, in the dungeon part where we're supposed to use the acid. So hold on. All right, we're back here in the we're back here in the dungeon. So we go over here. See this. Uh, stuff right here that we need to take. Let's use the acid. And the amber stone? I believe that needs to be, um, I think we need to go back up to that room, I think. That's where we need to put that stone. So, I will meet you. I'll meet you back up there. Okay then, back in room thirteen. So we need to. No, the glowing stone doesn't work. How are you supposed to put that there? Okay. Fishing line. Uh, okay, I think, well gee, that's weird, well hold on a second, let me figure out what I need to do next, I thought we were supposed to do this next, but this is apparently wrong, hold on, okay, I figure out what we need to do next, this is, this completely slipped my mind. Alright, this is what we need to do here. 
Remember that, that uh, bag of stones that we had? It is there. Hold on a second. It's... Are you gotta be fucking kidding me? Really? That's what we're supposed to do, though. Sometimes this game is so annoying. There we go. Okay, so we got bow. Okay, that belt buckle. Okay, I, okay, so I know what to do now. It has a special mark on it. Oh, okay. Yes, alright. This is where you use the stamper. Then you get the infinity symbol. So now we can now we can do two things. So now we can uh, go back to the uh, workshop, which is not too far from here. So I'll just go ahead and go. Um, let's go ahead and go back here because we're not that far. All right. So now what we need to do. See the infinity symbol right there. Now that wind up key is going to be um, used in the uh, in the dungeon area. But now, next thing we got to do, this belt buckle that you see here, what we need to do now is go here to the underground hall. Put the buckle on here. Grab the arrows. We use we use the wire for to hold the bow in place. There you go. So now what we can do is we use a bow and arrow. Shoot up there, shoot that down. Now we got that piece. Let's see, stone tablet. Hold on a second, let me see if I can figure out where that stone tablet goes. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back in the dungeon. Well, what we need to do over here is see see this right here. It's it's uh, missing. A gem is missing. So we got some amber stone. All right, now we're getting some. Hell, this is messed up. I almost found the place where they're keeping James when the sandstorm hit. These ancient Egyptian traps are still functional. I'm almost. What? Okay, why do they repeat it twice? Oh well, it doesn't matter. It's like they're missing some sort of uh, thing here. And I don't really think we have anything of that nature to I 
Earth Amulet. Oh, yes, I know where that goes. And you go back to the workshop for that. It will, it will um, open up this last one here. I'll open up this, this glowing cone. Now the glowing cone, I think it goes back, um, oh, I'm trying to remember what that, where that goes. I think that goes in the shrine here. See how well it goes in there? Alright, this is a, another tricky little puzzle that we had to figure out here. So, I'm going to try to figure this out. Let's see. Maybe is it right here? I just don't remember where this one goes. It says one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It says eight. See, this one has eight sides to it. Ah, oh, screw it. Oh, it's way over there. <laughs> screw it, I'm not gonna waste my time on that. It's... Yeah, I'm just not doing that. Okay. Alright. So, we're in this uh, really creepy looking shrine thing. Alright, so... Okay, let's look over here. Okay. That is a... Uh, something that goes to the dime, that which we'll... Don't have to worry about till later. So this is a tablet piece here. Oh, gee, how obvious. 
It's a really weird shaped key. Okay. So we looked over there. Okay, is there something else over here? Oh yeah, we can't do anything right there. Alright, so let's let's look at this weird contraption. It's missing a face. And some sort of bracelet. Oh, there's that scroll that we need, and whatever the hell that thing is. Okay. Well, it looks like we're getting towards the end of this game, I think, because we're pretty much almost done with this game, so. Let's see. What's all this about? Okay, this is a different puzzle. Um, what you have to do is you kind of have to match these. So, um, sorry. Yeah, these little bubbly things. Um, this one goes here. Okay. This one. Um, goes right there. Alright. So, alright. See that? There. That one. A little creepy. Okay, let's get this dust and stuff off. It's a key. The engraved keys. All right. Well, yeah. Looks like we got um. It needs to be holding some sort of sphere of some sort. I don't have anything on have anything of that nature. So well, what do we do with these two with these two keys, you say? We need to go back to room for thirteen, so I'll, I will meet you guys there. Okay, we are back. Now we are back to uh room thirteen here on the second floor. So remember these weird looking keys? mask and a gas can and see we have another engraved key that we could use there's a uh, some sort of ring alright so let's go um, the mask, we really can't do anything right now. Let's see. Let's have a look at this. I 
they ran out of gas. So let's um, put some gas on that sucker. And now this I'm still kind of stumped about. I'm gonna have to come back to that later. So let's go back to um, let's go back to the shrine. Okay, we're back at the shrine. Okay, well let's see. Our um our power our cutoff saw will get through the get through these wires. You know, if I can find some more ammo for my revolver, I'm probably scaring off. I don't know why that would work on Ghost, but hey, don't don't look at me. I don't I don't know. I mean, that's to me that's a little weird. Um, okay, so where, where are we going? Okay, yes. So get rid of that. Get rid of this weird sphinx. Okay, so we got the scroll now, so we can solve this puzzle. This puzzle's a little bit on the uh, tedious side. It's had to match these weird symbols. So. Apparently that. No, that's not it either. See? See what I mean? A lot of them, a lot of them look really. Okay, here we go. There's that one. This one's really fucking tedious. I don't know if you can tell that you can uh, have to... If I take too long, I'm just going to cut this out. Because... This is just going to... This is just going to get annoying. Uh... Alright, so we're looking at for that weird symbol. Uh, let's see. No, that's not it. I remember this one. This one took a long time. So I might... I might cut most of it out. You know what? I will meet you back once I, once I get to the last symbol so you can see what we get. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and finish this off screen. I'll be right back. Okay, well, I saw all one except for this one. Okay, so... It didn't take me as long as I thought. You know, last time it took me forever, but... Okay, let's... Uh, let's see. Let me do that, you know. There we go. Bye-bye, weird Trojan thingy. <laughs> or... Sphinx, or wherever the hell that is. Okay. Scorpion fragment. Is there another way to get it? Oh, yes, that's right. Cool thing. Okay, so I don't know what that was for. But alright, so we need something to pry that off. So it looks like we don't really have anything of this sort right now. So let's see what that did to our gun.
Okay. Why is it not doing anything? I guess um, I guess I need to find another bullet or something. I thought it came with a bullet. All right, well, never mind then. Well, that's just fucking annoying. Okay, well, I'll be right back. I gotta see what the let's see what the hell we gotta do next. Let's um. Well, before we do that, let's uh go back to the shrine. sword. Yeah, it looks like something is missing. Hmm. Scorpion fragment. Hmm. Ah, oh, yes, of course. Another, that's another thing on our another mysterious device that we can it is almost complete so he's got to figure out how to get to that one let's see the ring I don't remember let me let's see where the ring goes well, hold on okay we're back upstairs in the library I, I realized what we, were, what we had to do next the ring is actually a key. Here's a sphere. And the sphere goes um, goes on that casket thing, so I'll meet you guys there. Okay, we're back. Um, let's see. Oh, this is kind of fun. We need to do is you need to uh, guide this uh, figurine. Um. Oh. Through this uh, maze. What am I doing in a sarcophagus? The last thing I remember was meeting Mr. Shadowy at his hotel. I remember it felt like someone was watching me. I think I checked into my room, but it's fuzzy after that. I don't have much to offer you, but please, take this as a thanks for saving me. Well, that sucks. What this Mr. Shadowy's doing is really... It's fucking creepy, and it shouldn't he not be, um, must be that pharaoh guy that's controlling him or something. I don't know. But, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and stop it here for this episode, but, uh, next time we will see, um, about freeing our poor assistant James and any other people that are trapped, and, uh, hopefully they'll be finishing this game soon, so, um, as always, uh, appreciate you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.